Hey everyone, my name is Marshall Mind, bringing you a brand new video. And in this video, we're gonna try to get a fight with Rampage Jackson. Um, the last fight that I posted was with Brock Lesnar. Um, he's the first legend that I've showed so far. And in this video, I'm gonna try to showcase Rampage Jackson. And depending on how fast or long the fight is, I might um I might do another one with Matt. Matt Hughes it depends it all depends on if the fight is quick or if if it takes all three rounds but um Rampage Jackson is rated a 91 stand up 90 and stand up uh you know the kickbox and it, it's combined with his clinch stats so it was a 90 ground game 90 submissions 89 his uh stats right there what I care about is his takedown defense and his endurance and uh his endurance is a uh, 68, stamina 65, which is really not bad, you know, because there are a lot of people. It's it's really close to John Jones's and uh, Gustafson's endurance, so it's pretty good. His uh his abilities, heavy-handed, that's the important one right there. So uh, let's get this fight on the way. I really hope it's not a mirror match. Um, I had one fight with Rampage Jackson. Um, and I really, really enjoyed using Rampage Jackson. His his hands just feel amazing. Um, you know, I think he's fast. I love. I just you know I, I'm not a big fan of all the move sets that he has. You know all the spinning strikes and oh look at this! A classic fight is about to happen. Rampage Jackson versus Chuck, the Iceman Liddell. This is gonna be good. Let's just hope my opponent brings it. I want to have a good fight here. Looks like I'm in the blue corner. Let's look at Rampage a little bit. Let's take a look at this guy. Um, you know, a lot of people were disappointed uh, with his entrance. You know, when Rampage usually comes into the octagon, he usually has his chain on his neck, and he usually does the, you know, the howl. But he doesn't do it here. You know, I, I believe it's just a lack of time. When you look at his model, he looks just like Rampage Jackson. They they put a lot of detail into this model. It looks just like him. I love his shorts too. It's just he looks good. He looks really good. But yeah, let's let's get this fight on the way. Let's see what happens. <laughs> Hopefully, I don't lose this one. All right. So who am I fighting? Touch gloves, buddy. Nope. Subtle enemy. He's already kicking my legs. Let's watch out for that. That scores points in the judges. So, but you know, we'll let him. We'll let him throw it. You know, this. I can already tell that this guy is not very good. You know, I can already tell he's not very good. He's not. He's just. He's just throwing whatever, whatever button combinations comes to mind. He's really not. He's really not thinking about what he's throwing. But the the thing is, these these are the kind of people you gotta be worried about because this game is retarded, man. It takes the control out of the out of the hands of the player, and he could rock me with any one of the any one of these bombs. Wow, look at that. Ho. Oh. Chuck Liddell, you can't take much of that. And the fight is over. Wow, that was quick. That was too fast. That was too fast. That was too fast. We're gonna do one more. We'll do one more rampage. That was just way too fast. That's that power, man. Boom! Fight over. You have to be careful with that power. That is insanity right there. Awesome. Uh I don't know. I don't I don't wanna spend too much time on this video. Yeah, we'll just we'll try to get a fight with Matt Hughes. Try to get a fight with Matt Hughes. That was way too fast. I was hoping it would last a little longer, but that was just too fast. It's okay, though. Hope you guys enjoyed that one. I sure enjoyed knocking him out. <laughs> one more thing. that it, What is it with people thinking I am some kind of white nerd? I mean, what is it about my voice that makes people think I'm white? I don't get it. You know, you know, people say, you don't sound black. What does it mean to sound black? I don't know. What does a black guy sound like? I don't know. I, I guess, oh, shit, I forgot to show you guys the stats. Oh, whatever. Why? Because I'm not, you know, because I ain't sound like this, you know what I'm saying? Because I ain't using words like this. That what y'all niggas mean? You know what I mean?
<laughs> that sounds so stupid. Look, I don't talk like that. This is the way that I talk. Um, you know, I've told you guys before. I am. I'm not American. I'm Nigerian. I, I grew up in. I grew up in Africa. I grew up in Nigeria, and Nigeria was colonized by the British. So, um, the English, the way we, the way we speak, it's definitely different. You know, my accent is, has slowly gone away because I've I've been here for about five years. So my accent has kind of it's kind of disappeared a little bit. When I'm angry and when I'm upset or when I'm really excited, you can kind of hear the accent a little bit. But um, for the most part, it's it's uh. It's a little bit gone right now, so I don't understand why people think I sound white, but, you know, I don't mind. It's okay. I don't mind sounding like a white guy. It's all right. Matt Hughes looks pink. He's got pink skin, or he's just really white, but he looks great. His model looks awesome. It looks just like him. Who are we fighting? We are fighting Nick Diaz. All right. This guy might, he might try to bull rush me and try to get me out of there real quick. Or he might just hang back. Or he might just throw kicks. We'll see. Either way, I'm going to, uh, I'm not going to stand with, with Nick Diaz too much. I don't want to get rocked. It depends. If I, if, I, if I feel it, if I believe I can get him out of there on the feet, I'm going to stand with him. But I'm mostly just going to take this guy down because he's literally feeding me those kicks. He's like inviting me to take him down. Yeah, welcome to the ground. Stacked. Pass. And right here is how you know a player that's good or not. Defend it. He didn't. Well, there you go. Let's see if I can let's see if I can hold mount a little bit. We're holding it. And you know, this is a position that a lot of people have been complaining about right now. And it's, you know, it's a very tough position. But the good thing about this position is that it's very hard to get to. It's very hard. Wow. I'm, I'm sitting here talking and I didn't deny that transition. Right now, defending against mount from side control is it's, it's very easy. But he, he's not defending it, you know. He's not defending it. He should be defending that transition. Yeah, mount is, you know, mount is really tough. This is very interesting. Very, very interesting. All right. He got me up. Very, very, very interesting. All right. I'm going to have to, when I mount him again, because... But the thing with mount is sometimes, you know, you have to really, really watch your stamina to be able to hold that position. And it, it looks like Matt Hughes doesn't have the best stamina in this game. He, he kind of reminds me of BJ Penn, like a much bigger BJ Penn. And Nick Diaz is letting his hands go. Looks like he's mad, so we'll just let him. We'll just let him. Okay, keep throwing all that. It's okay. We'll just let him. <laughs> okay. Okay. Hopefully he doesn't rock me with something random. Back up. Going for my body though. Got him with that. Boom, 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 boom. Back up, back up. Okay. Oh wow. Yeah, <laughs> Matt Hughes is uh, he's good, but he just doesn't have the con he doesn't have the endurance that I that I that I love using. It's just he's getting tired too quickly. Like I said, it reminds me of B J Penn. It's I get the same kind of feeling. Like when I use B J Penn, you know, his stand up is really good. His ground game is really good, but. The endurance kind of betrays me a little bit. I love fighters that have really good stamina. And this dude is going... He is just spinning. Okay. Alright. <laughs> okay. Alright. He's, he's really enjoying those leg kicks. Sorry, man. You can't throw leg kicks off your back. 
And if if you let him, okay, let's see. If you let him keep throwing th those leg kicks, he will win this fight strictly on that mount. All right, we're gonna hold this mount right now. We're gonna watch our stamina. We're gonna hold this mount. I'm gonna go one shot, defend, one shot, defend, just like that. And we posture up so the referee doesn't stand us up. Occasionally, we po oh shit, I meant okay. I'm done talking. Sorry, but I can't. I, I can't. I can't really. I can't really play this. This right here, right now, while talking. So I'm gonna. I'm gonna shut up. Oh, son of a bitch. Mount. Hold it. Hold it. Give up his back. Defend that. Hold. Okay. Watch your stamina. Yeah, I can't. I'm I'm really, really watching that stamina. And when he start when he's spinning around like that. If you notice, I'm just, like, riding him. I'm not doing anything. I'm not trying to block. All right, this fight's over. When he's spinning around like that, I'm not doing anything. I just, I let go of my controller, and I just ride him. Because, one, if, if I try to block those transitions, it's going to waste stamina. I'm not going to be able to block the rest. It's just going to be a, a mess. With me, when I'm on top like this, it's position first before damage i want to hold the position before i do any damage and you know people you know when people say that mounts is really really tough and it's really overpowered i i do agree that mount is sort of overpowered but i'm gonna say this again the balance to that position is that it's very difficult to get to i believe ea should completely take off the ability to mount someone after you trip them i, I think that's you know it shouldn't be in the game but if someone takes you down and they make their way from guard to half guard to side control all the way to mount. In my opinion, they deserve to be in mount because making your way all the way from guard to mount, it's a very difficult thing to do. Sometimes even impossible against a really good player. So it is balanced in a, in a sense. But, you know, of course, I would love it if the next game mount was a little bit easier to defend against and to escape but it should also be easier to get to you know that's that's where the balance comes in but that's pretty much it for this video hope you guys enjoyed it let me know in the comment section what you think about rampage jackson let me know in the comment section what you think about matt hughes and uh you know uh, do you enjoy using these fighters the only fighter that's left for me to use right now is um mark coleman and he's gonna be a tough one to use um, but sometime tomorrow, I'm going to try to get a fight with Mark Coleman, so watch out for that. Once again, thank you for watching, guys. Leave a like if you enjoyed or a dislike if you did not enjoy. Either one is fine by me. I will see you guys in the next video. Be safe.